It's time for KH Sports, presented by Glen St. Motors, celebrating 70 years in business. Caleb puts it on the floor, guarded by Xavier Brown. Nine seconds, eight seconds. Caleb, top of the key to Freddie. Freddie Hicks dribbles with the right hand. On to the wing, three seconds, two seconds. Freddie has to put it up. Shot goes! Freddie Hicks has won the game! Chris, the Oscars are tonight, and I don't know if you could have scripted anything better than this. Arkansas State had only been to the Sun Belt Championship game twice in program history, and tomorrow will mark the third, and they did it in possibly the most dramatic fashion in recent history. This one was a back and forth start. Caleb Fields lobbed Isaiah Nelson waking up the crowd with a slam, and the Red Wolves take the early lead, but Trayvon Spillers counters with a dunk of his own. App led it eight to six, but Darian Ford connects from the corner. A State takes the one point lead and they would hold that lead for a while. Fields steals. Freddie Hicks throws it up for Nelson. Yet another alley-oop jam. Then later, Fields drives, count it, and one. Red Wolves are up by five, but on the other end, App hanging around. Donovan Gregory to Spillers. Yet another slam, but A-State not phased. Taryn Todd steps back, buries the triple. The Red Wolves push the lead to nine, but the Mountaineers with the response. Jordan Marsh steals and scores, but the Red Wolves led it by 10 at the break. Second half, Fields dumps to Hicks. Caleb with six assists tonight. Fields racks up another one later on. This one to DeAndre Dominguez from downtown, and A-State is back up nine. App trailed this one by as much as 11, but they're rallying. Jordan Tate knocks down the jumper. Then Xavier Brown hands off to Terrence Harcum, and the lead is down to two, 56. 54. The Red Wolves needing a response in the worst way. They get one from Caleb Fields. Deep in the shot clock, he's free for three. It's 59-54. But the Mountaineers counter. Miles Tate bounces. Justin Absent slams and App State takes the lead on the heels of a 6-0 run. They're up two with over two minutes left. Fields, he was clutch today. Drives and finishes. That ties it up. Game high 23 points for Caleb today. The Red Wolves get a stop. They have it with under 15 seconds left. They'll put the ball in Cersei native Freddie Hicks' hands. And Hicks sends the Red Wolves to their first Sun Belt Championship game since 2007. Arkansas State wins 67 to 65. My teammates just trusted me to make the right play. You know, at the end, um, I said I wanted the ball, and, you know, they trusted me. You know, we just ran a play and it just worked out, but really could have anybody could have hit that shot. And it's just it's a it's a good moment, but we didn't come here just to win two games, you know. You know, so we got one more left and we know what's at stake and really excited to have a chance to win the championship. We went into that timeout and uh he looked me in the eye, he grabbed me actually, and said, Coach, give me a ball and we'll win the basketball game. And uh and, and I'm not I'm not making that up. He said it to me about three times. I said, I got you, I got you. He said, Give me a ball, I'm gonna win us this game. And uh, that, and, and he's proven that he has that in him. Not one dude in that timeout questioned it. One, everybody said, let's do it. Let's get Freddie the ball. Uh, so we ran a play to, to, to get Freddie a keep. Uh, and, and App actually did a great job guarding it. They kept him out of the paint. Uh, and he hit a tough shot right after telling us that that's what he was going to do. It's when I go home. So when you're in that position, you just got to get out of stop and make it happen. And that's what we did. Obviously tonight, I mean, the last two nights, we went out there and played, played our butts off, and we're not done yet. We got one more to win. The Red Wolves are one win away from their first NCAA tournament appearance since 1999. Reporting in Pensacola, Florida, Logan Whaley, KH Sports.